Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I am Hamad Youssef. The representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, expressed pleasure at the distinguished victory achieved by the team Bahrain McLaren, winning the first place at the Getsco Circus in Spain and the second round of the Route Octania Tour in France. His Highness Sheikh Nasser praised the victory of the cyclist Damiana Caruso at the first place in the Getsco Circuit and the victory of the cyclist Sony Colibrelli at the circulation of Rocco Octania in France. His Highness affirmed that these victories are an extension of the series of continuous victories that the team has achieved in past races, noting that the victory is an obtaining the first place after stopping for several months due to the coronavirus pandemic motivates the team to continue their development and make achievements in future participations. His Highness Sheikh Nasser noted that Bahrain McLaren team's winning first place in the Getsco circuit in Spain and the Tour of Octania in France affirms Bahrain's distinguished status in cycling. His Highness stated that the Bahrain McLaren team's successful return affirms the optimal preparation for the team in the past period. Bahrain denounced the hostile statements of the Turkish Defense Minister Hulusi Akar regarding the UAE, considering them an unacceptable pr provocation that contradicts diplomatic norms and a threat to a brotherly Arab country that is known for its constructive role in the international community. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs affirms solidarity with the Kingdom with the UAE regarding the Turkish interventions in the internal affairs of Arab countries, which contradicts the principles of the United Nations Charter and the Organization of Islamic Cooperation and represents a threat to Arab national security and regional peace. The Ministry of Housing said that the Housing Committee concerned with discussing housing requests for urgent and humanitarian cases discussed 621 cases on the committee's list during the first half of this year. The Housing Ministry stated that the committee made decisions to provide urgent housing solutions to 345 humanitarian cases following a thorough study of all aspects of the case from medical reports and conducting field visits and social research for each individual application. The ministry stated that the number of meetings held by the committee during the first half of 2020 has reached 50 meetings with an average of two meetings per week. The Ministry of Health said today that the number of coronavirus cases reached 2,832 with 371 recoveries, 208 registered new cases. 75 of the new registered cases are expatriates, 132 are contacts of active cases and one travel related. The Ministry of Health urges everyone to adhere to the rules, follow instruction and avoid public places when possible.